Good morning, it's about 5 a.m. It's still dark outside. And as you can see, I have the snake already prepared with the charcoal around the outside of the kettle grill. I have a little lighter cube getting things started for me. And as usual, since I'm trying to cook this slow, I have a pan of water that will help keep the moisture and temperature level more consistent for the Boston butt that I'm gonna be cooking today. Once that lighter cube finishes its business, I'll go ahead and put the grate on and I will put on the Boston butt. It's gonna be wrapped up for the first probably five, six hours and then I'll unwrap it and give it some time without anything just to uh, get some color and some more smoke and even though it's going to be wrapped up it's not going to be like 20 wraps of foil uh, smoke will still be able to get inside the foil it's just going to be a more protective barrier to keep it from being overcooked i am having to do a second lighter cube because the first one didn't really take yet so I'm putting a piece of charcoal on top and beside the wood, so hopefully that will be the, the fuel needed to keep it running this time. And that's why you don't just put stuff on the grill and go back to bed, because you wanna make sure that it does stay going. So I'm probably gonna be up for a couple hours just to make sure once I do put the, the food on, because you don't want the grill to go get way too cold and then you wake up hours later and be like uh what my, my food's not cooking yeah don't be that guy salad. Uh, this morning I had scrambled eggs and bacon for breakfast and that's what it came off of. How pretty is that? And it is delicious. So I'm gonna enjoy that because that salad dressing is the only carbs that I've had for the day so I'm well under my 20 and I'll have a good day.